Hi everyone, how is the healing going today? I hope you're out of pain and things are going well. Um, doing your physiotherapy exercises and eating well, sleeping well. I wanted to show you two things today if you had a, um, a radial distal fracture. And actually these two things would be good for any broken arm or wrist or your hand. So um, if it's not a distal radius fracture, no problem. These two bits of uh, information might come in handy anyway. Uh, one is about um, the sling that you can use, which... I have right here. Uh, I don't have a cast on anymore, but I can still put this on and show you. Uh, this is the one that they gave me when uh, I first went to the hospital. Um, won't be as quick and easy for you to get it in there, but you can still do it. It just takes a little bit of fiddling around when you have a cast on. Uh, but the reason I like this is because it was it gave me a really good feeling of security that this was very, very tight. I'm going to put this down just a little bit so you can see. They, they've got a strap around here that goes around your waist and goes through a little ring at the bottom here. And it's got Velcro on it so you can just pull it tight around your back. And then it feels like it's nice and tight up against your body so that it's not going to fly out. or no, Even if somebody bumped into it, you feel like you have it protected. And um, I, I was always sort of pushing it back this way so that I could keep my arm up because, of course, you know that you have to keep your arm up as much as possible or whatever injured part you have should be raised above the level of the heart uh, to try to prevent any swelling. Um, so that was one thing I wanted to show you. Um, I'm sure that they gave you something when you broke your arm in the hospital, but just in case, try to get one of these. I think it's... Um, I'll read the name off of it. I think it's Landmark Services or something like that where it came from. Um, nice and comfortable. Kind of stylish too, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, the second thing I wanted to show you is uh, for people who have long hair and you know if you've got one arm down and uh, you can't use it, it's impossible to put your hair up in a ponytail. It was driving me crazy for a week or so when I first broke my arm back in January 2017. And uh, I watched a bunch of YouTube videos and somewhere I found this method of doing it. At first I tried to actually use an elastic to wind my hair around and actually try to get the elastic around the hair. It was almost impossible. So <clears throat> I had some clips. So get a clip, something like this. I got mine at Shoppers Drug Mart or you get them anywhere where they have hair salons or hair supplies. And Here's what I found is the easiest way to take care of your hair when you're trying to get it up. Wind it around like this, somewhere near a wall. Wall is against, or your head is against the wall. And put the clip in. There we go. It's not a ponytail, but my hair is pretty much out of the way. Well, I left one strand down, but I could wind that around and get it out of the way. So hopefully that helps you. I know that it's really difficult for everyday ordinary things when you've got one arm out of action. And this was just one little thing that made my life easier. So I wanted to pass that on to you if you've got a distal radius fracture or any other uh, bone that's broken in your arm. Good luck. I hope things are going well and you're not in pain and that you're continuing your physiotherapy. Bye for now.